Now you're going to be releasing uh, the Still Psycho after all these years album, which uh, you re-recorded during the Lights Camera Revolution sessions. Why have you decided to do that? Now I handled the very first question very nicely. Now I won't be so nice. Basically, when Suicidal started off, I guess there's three parts to that. We didn't start off, my best friend said, you know, before I was going in the studio, he goes, why are you making that record? It's not music, people won't like it. I said, I don't really give a damn what people like because I don't like too many people and their opinions don't matter, you know? They're judgmental on me, I don't have to be judgmental on them. We did the music because of the music at the time they called new music we didn't like, you know? And uh, it's a situation for us, it's 10 years later, and what the music people call new music to me is completely boring. It's a bunch of 70s rock, it's lame, with people have a different look and stuff. And as I said, you know, you take I Saw Your Mommy institutionalized and you put it up against any quote new music and I think it's going to come out on top. And I don't say that as, as, as uh, uh, bragging, I say that's terrible. Because music that's 10 years old, you could still like it, but like it because you liked it then, you know. It should not be able to stand up to music nowadays. And that's the problem with music. I think too many people are too willing to get down there to kiss people's butt instead of getting out there and doing their own thing. That's why we're at a place like this where everybody's here because they want to fit in because they're too scared to make their own direction, do the thing. That's the problem with music. Everyone wants to fit in. Everyone wants to be liked. And when going back to the question, why we play with Italic and Guns N' Roses? Because I know a lot of people won't like us, and that's the way it should be you know it shouldn't everyone wants to be liked why do you want to be so liked why can't you just be satisfied with liking yourself trying to figure out who you want to be and go with that everyone wants to worry about what everyone else is thinking and it's bullshit and it's stupid and so the whole point is it's not to be popular sometimes it's better not to be liked because when people don't like you for the wrong reasons there's something wrong and we say the number one reason why people don't like suicidal is because they haven't heard the music so we'll go in front of Madonna we'll go in front of anybody because the music I liked I didn't hear Jimi Hendrix when he first came came out I was six or five years old or something but when I heard it I liked it and I think there's a lot of people that even though we have five or six records that have never heard us when they hear it they're gonna go you know what there's something there and that's why we're here and if people don't like it because they don't like the way I look well they could stick it right up wherever they want to because <laughs> I don't really give a damn Yeah, 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 yeah. 
to write lyrics and get things out of your system? I, I don't really so. It's a it's a situation. I don't like read. I don't go to movies because I get bored stiff, you know, and stuff. And I don't sit there and write with a piece of paper. It's the music, and I think music has a feel, and music sh should move you, because I know the reason why I got into music is because, not before I was in a band, it was because I heard certain songs and I liked them, and certain things about them, it like motivated you to do things, or it made you feel a certain way, or reminded you of things. And I think music should have a feel, and I think the problem is a lot of times people want to be so clever with what they say, they go, yeah, check out this song, and it's a piece of paper with words and a song that's a poem you know and I think the easiest thing in the world is to write a poem because there's nothing there you leave it to the, the imagination of the person there's no emotion it's just wood you know that got chopped down and stuff and I think it's the music you have to go with the music and to take it somewhere and it's and it's a situation that's be honest so you can't hide behind something and I think it should go with the music and and it should you know be an extension of it you know